What's up guys? It's Alex in Monsterland. Today I'm going to draw this character and then turn it into a printable paper miniature character for tabletop gaming or other fantasy art project. Okay, let's get started. Hey, thanks for watching my channel. Please take a second and click the thumbs up icon to like this video and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my upcoming projects. At the end of the video, I'll let you know how to get a free download of this project. Welcome to Monster Land, Monster Land, Monster Land. You lost inside of Monster Land. Hey guys, today we're going to draw a uh, creature, a mushroom shaped creature, and I'm calling him Deathcap. So I started this one with a, uh, with a reference image. I searched uh, Google Images and found a picture of a mushroom that I liked. And yes, it is not an actual death cap mushroom, but I like the shape of it. And we're just gonna call him that. That's a cool creature name. So that's the shape I kind of want. And the first thing I'm gonna do is I turn down the opacity and start drafting my rough lines on it. So I'm, in this case, I'm gonna copy it basically the exact same shape with the ribbing and the stock and the curvature in the stock because I like that. I think that'll work well. And then I'm going to add some creature features, arms, legs, claws, that kind of thing, face, right? So over top of that, and I've got that basic shape. We'll get rid of the back layer. That's basically what it'll look like. And then we'll clean up the lines and that's death cap. So next thing to do is to add some little features onto it. It's a mushroom, so I thought it needs, it usually has spots on the cap, you know, typical mushroom in comics or cartoons. Um, in this case, I want them to look kind of toxic or diseased. So uh, add some bumps up top instead of circles and then circles on the bottom, bottom half of the stock who looks kind of like he's toxic or something. So uh, I like the look of that. So we'll get to some coloring. So I chose the colors basically um, very similar to the reference image, right? Reds and grays and whites and stuff. Um, and we just went with that. And so the next thing I want to do is kind of define the ribbing there and the depth of all that. Add some uh, color to the spots and shading there. And then just deepen this part here underneath to show that it's, it goes in. So it's a little bit darker there. Looking pretty good so far. And then we just want to add some shading to the body itself. Get some little texture there. And then some shading and texture to the cap. And there you have a death cap. So next thing to do. We'll flip them over to another screen and turn them into a PNG and add the base and get them ready for printing. Okay, so there's death cap on a, a new worksheet. So he's about, he's like an inch and a three quarters by two and a half inches tall. Uh, I guess it's two inches plus the base here. So there's the half circle base with the flooring and we're gonna duplicate this layer and flip it vertical on top so that we can fold them in half along this line, which I'll get rid of. Uh, or we can fold it and we can just cut around it. It's no big deal. We will cut them and uh, glue them in half and add them to this would be the, the base we're going to add them to. And that just fits, as you can see, a little bit larger than uh, the floor base. So that would be perfect. Okay, let's send them to the printer and assemble them. Thanks again for watching. Check out my projects and get free downloads on my Patreon page by clicking the link in the description below.